How can two students use their passion for rock climbing and filmmaking to create a research project for all to enjoy? We take you on an adventure from behind the scenes. TCNJ students Jeremy Sable and Matt Mentonis invited me on one of their geology research missions to show me exactly what they are doing together. And with COSA, so uh, Celebration of Student Achievement, it was either create like a poster, um, present the information, or you could create a film. So we, uh, you know, Matt, Tyler, and I kind of, we always joked about creating a film, but we we're like, let's actually do this. And now we have an excuse to do it. Jeremy's research entails 3D modeling of cliffs and natural features, where he studies the movement of different fallen rocks to predict their likelihood of occurrence and what can be done for protection. Mentonis talks about his role in the documentary. Jeremy was like, actually, I have the opportunity to be able to make like a little film um, for the geology department, and we can incorporate climbing into it because we want to do it anyway. So like, now I got my work cut out for me to edit a video and film a video and for, for Jeremy's little project. But I, yeah, sure, I guess so. I guess so. Why is incorporating rock climbing as important to the filming of the documentary? Jeremy explains. You know, with what research we're doing, you can't do the research without um, the access to the cliffs, and, which includes climbing. So having the climbing part is just as important as having the research. Jeremy and Matt are reaching the end of their time exploring together and are beginning to look back on their memories fondly. This is what it's all about. Like, it was more about like, for me, it's, it's always been more about like chasing the memories and like the experiences and like being around people who are super passionate about what they're doing. I mean, the content has been awesome and it's been really cool getting to film all this, but just being able to spend time with them and, and create these memories and them being um, like documented is really cool. The research documentary is being displayed in the physics building on Tuesday, April 25th, where all are welcome for entry. I'm Mark Shell from Lions News.